What's up? CampingGearTV.com. I'm Josh. I'm Ben. And we're back at you again. We got another exciting episode today. Both of us are wearing hats because yep. that's what we're taking a look at today. Hats. A couple of hats. Yep. And uh, you don't usually think camping or backpacking when you think of hats, right? You think about tents and coolers and stuff like that and backpacks. Right? Well, when you're backpacking, you're, mm -hmm. you know, and you're out in the outdoors, you could be in some weather that where the sun is just blistering. Right. And you're going to pick up a hat and bring it with you, but are you thinking about bringing the right hat with you? Right. And so this is why we're looking at the product that we're looking at today. Mm -hmm. We actually got two hats, obviously. They're both from the same company. They're both a little different. So yep. these, these come from our friends at Outdoor Research. So we, uh, we thank you guys very much for sending these out. And I'll be honest, at first I was thinking like, oh, it'll be nice, we'll get a couple hats and we can wear them, and yada, yada, yada. But they're, they're actually, they're made a little differently than a regular, say, baseball cap that you're used to. Uh, the construction's a little different and features kind of uh, pertain to, you know, being outside and getting mm -hmm. all sweaty. Something everyone likes to do. A little sweaty. Sweating little, it out. Sweating to the outdoors. Like Richard Simmons. So, um... I guess we'll just start talking about each one. My cap is called the Ferocity Cap. Oh. And uh, it has... Is that because it's ferocious? It is ferocious. So you can see some of the features that are on here where the uh, the silver lining is. Those are reflective areas. So at night, you know, if you if you use this one, really? you're like, yeah. Oh, like that's nice. Trail running or, or running at night, you know, this uh, that reflects so you can see yourself easier. The, uh, the hats are really, really light. This one, let me check here, 2.2 ounces. The one that Josh is is 2.5. So they're really, really light, and a large percentage of them is, is has these uh, mesh. Josh's right. is fully mesh. Mine has mesh sides. Yeah. So it provides a greater amount of uh, ventilation for, for your head, mm -hmm. you know, and is able to, you know, let the heat out so you're not just, like, sweating to death in your hat. Um, I've, I've noticed... Yeah. I've noticed while using these, what's actually kind of a nice feature is how they're designed, um, especially Josh's. If you're to see here, uh, this top bit is completely separate from the hat. Can we see this? So this uh, this netting material underneath kind of helps wick and ventilate all the moisture, so you don't really. But the uh, the top bit never hits your head, so you never. You never have any problems having that nasty sweat brim that you get yeah. on. A, that doesn't show up on those. You really? can be sweating your butt off, and it doesn't. It doesn't soak into the hat. That's pretty cool. So that one does it a little better than 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 mine does. Josh's is a swift cap, by the way. Mine's the ferocity for ferocious. I would guess this one might cost a little more. The swift? Yes. You're wrong. Wow. Yeah. Even with all those features. Well, mine has some features too. Oh. So that are kind of nice. Um, so both of them have the, the mesh panels that help wick and ventilate, and mine has the reflective stripes. They both have this uh, adjustable strap in the back that, you know, it, it's all very, uh, you know, it's, it's very lightweight, I would say. Mm -hmm. And uh, the, cool thing, the cool thing I like about mine is the brim folds. Oh. Josh's does not. No. So there's like a little break in the brim, and it's supposed to fold. It's supposed to fold that way so you can like, you know, quickly like package that up put it in your pocket and uh, you're good to go. And, That's nice. Yeah, so that way you're, you know, an, another hat you might be worried that the brim is, you know, you're, you're hurting the brim when you fold it and this one here, you can see how small it folds up to. Very, very nice. So mine costs $24 on Outdoor Research's website. Yours costs 20 but I found them for as low as like, um, like 15 and 14 from other sites if you do your That's homework. Nice. That's a good yeah. one. So, uh, you know, for what is their site? Outdoorresearch.com? Yeah, I believe so. I would have had a link to it earlier in the, in the show. So, but they got tons of stuff on there. And we actually got another product from them that we're going to take a look at later. So, lots of good stuff. And, yeah. I, and I'll just I'll go ahead and, and throw this out there. This past week, we just got a ton of new gear. A lot of stuff coming in. So, we got a lot of episodes coming up. We're going to be featuring a lot of products. So, and I uh, guess a couple bigger announcements coming in a yep. little while. So, definitely make sure you come back, leave comments, check out our videos, keep up to date with us, and we'll constantly be showing the latest and greatest in outdoor gear. So, 
Again, this is the Ferrosi and the Swift Cap from Outdoor Research. Check them out. I am Ben, this is Josh, and we are CampingGearTV.com. See you next time.